So I'm sure you and your brothers or sisters did a lot of stupid stuff when you were little. Well, if you had brothers or sisters, and if not, I'm sorry your parents didn't love you. But growing up, me and my brother Noah took doing stupid stuff to the extreme. So you see, when my brother was a kid, he was the type that the teachers in school would take one look at and be like, yep, that kid's got a knife collection. And you know what? They'd be right. He did have a knife collection. But along with knives, we also had other weird weaponry that kids probably shouldn't have, like ninja stars. And I don't mean little crappy toy ones. You think the kid with a knife collection would have toy ninja stars? No. These were the real deal, sharp and dangerous ninja stars. And most of the time, we would have a soda can or some kind of target to throw them at. And other times, we'd get some dumb idea and our brain cells would be like, Karen! Karen, we have to go now. Hurry up. But Bill... But Bill nothing. I told you we had to be ready to go for this bit. Now go get the kids. Where are the bags? Well, Bill, I got busy and forgot. Karen. I took a second mortgage out for that fancy wedding ring because What's-Her-Face, from the Real Housewives of Nobody Gives a shit, had one that looked just like it. And you couldn't have the bags ready. Well, you know, Bill, it's always about you. Jesus Christ! Here we go again. I didn't even start at this time. You started Well, it. if you didn't have the freaking bags... If you had the freaking bags ready, we would not be arguing right now. It's always what you want, Bill. Never what I want. Well, you wanted that fancy wedding ring, didn't you? And I got you that. Okay. Like I was saying, when we didn't have a target or something to throw them at, we would just be bored watching TV and fling right into the walls of our house. <laughs> God, I feel bad for our parents. I bet they never got a security deposit back. But we did this pretty often, and you know when you're a kid, you don't really think about how bad a ninja star messes up a wall until there's holes everywhere. I mean, it looked like a group of ninjas that sucked at being ninjas came into our house and missed every throw. Looking back, that's probably the reason Santa never brought us more ninja stars. <laughs> but along with ninja stars, one of our favorite things to shoot in the house, was our blow dart gun. <laughs> I mean, come on, we had the coolest parents a kid could want. Well, all of that ended after... The incident. So one day, me and my brother Noah were watching TV in the living room. I wasn't really paying attention, but in the corner of my eye, I saw Noah shooting the blow dart gun at the wall. Now, I have to mention that during this time, our other little brother, Ashton, who had to have been like four or five years old, was nowhere to be seen. Well, Noah raised the blow dart gun, took aim at the wall near the recliner, and fired. And in that same moment, Ashton's face popped out from behind the recliner and right into the line of fire. A silence filled the air, and then... I look over, and the dart had gone directly into his eye. I teleported over to him to help. Are you okay? And when I pulled the dart, his eye popped right out and was dangling. And no, that's not what happened. <laughs> it could have, but it didn't. What actually happened was, Ashton looked at me and seemed fine. But when he turned his head to look at Noah, everyone including Ashton realized there was a five inch star sticking out of his forehead. He was actually fine besides a little tiny hole on his forehead, and he didn't even start crying until he saw the dart fall and swing past his eyes. But I have one of those brains that immediately puts the worst possible scenario in your head. So I started thinking about how an inch to the left or to the right would have hit and went through one of his eyes. I'll just sum up the next part by saying I lost it on my brother Noah. <laughs> and it was a complete accident. It's not like he shot his little brother intentionally. Or did he? I guess we'll never know. But I'm sure you can guess the moral of the story. Don't annoy your siblings or you might get shot in the face. <laughs> Just kidding. Don't shoot blow dart guns or throw ninja stars in your house, especially if you have pets or little kids around. Unless you want a cyclops for a little brother. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. All right. Thanks for stopping by. And before I go, I just want to mention that I obviously don't have an upload schedule and some videos take longer than others to come out. So if you really want to see my videos, subscribe and click the bell below me and then select all.
you'll get a notification when I post a video. And listen, I rarely do that for YouTubers because I don't want to get a notification every other day about them. But I don't upload that often, so it's like one notification a month, which isn't bad. But whether you do or not, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Alright, later.